I'm here at CES and after walking the show floor, my feet are very tired, but I might have an answer and it's also the answer to the future of urban mobility. Now, imagine you have a giant car and it takes you to and from work every day, a really short trip for one person. Well, imagine if you could combine the convenience of a car with a bike and fuse it together. That's what this is. It's called the Veloz from French company Wello. Now, it's designed to give you pedal power but with a bit of assistance from a battery. So I'll show you inside. You can sit up front and pedal kind of like you would a regular bike. Um, but it's also got a battery built in that means it'll make it much easier for you to go up a hill. Now, in the back, you can carry your entire family if they're very small, or you can turn this area into a cargo space. Now, it's designed to go at a speed of about 15 to 25 miles per hour, and that's due to European regulations. And with the battery and the pedal assistance, you'll get a range of about 25 to 35 miles. But if you use the solar panels, which is an added extra on top, you might get a range of about 60 miles. And because this is the future, this iPad tells me exactly what I need to know about the vehicle. So imagine you have a fleet of these vehicles around the city. You'll be able to see them in real time and track them through the streets, seeing things like their speed, their battery usage, how much charge is left on the solar panels, and because we live in the eco-conscious age, how many carbon emissions you've saved. But enough of the iPad now. I don't know about you, this seems clunkier than a bike, and obviously we've seen in a number of cities around the world now bikes with that kind of added oomph of a battery power. But I like the idea of being protected from the elements. I like the idea of taking, let's not lie, my very adorable dog in the back. And it seems to me like a pretty good option if you don't want to go out for a car, but maybe you don't want to just be schlepping around on a bike. I don't know if it's going to let me like cycle around CES, but I reckon I could give it a try. All right. It's locked. They've definitely locked it because of people like me. All right, this one here, which is the family model, it's designed for consumers. It's available to pre-order now, starting at 4,900 euro, which is about five and a half grand US. But for optional extras, you can, ca can get things like the solar panels on the roof or deluxe interiors. They're also doing a B2B model that has more of a cargo feel or a bit of a pickup truck style vibe. I don't know if it's for me, you're going to look certainly very interesting uh, fanging around the city in one of these, but I think it's definitely a great option for the future of transport. If you want to see more cool, amazing stuff like this from the CES show floor, then make sure you subscribe to CNET, where we have all of your future tech needs.